now that we have 12 inches of fresh snow on the ground and every spot that I was taking wood from is buried, both of the two sections that I had been getting the past wood from at my neighbors, they're going to be pretty muddy. My wood yard also going to be muddy until this snow melts. We got to see how long it's going to take. It's melting pretty good today, even though it's only about 20, 22 degrees. So we're in the, the cabinet shop today, and I, I wanted to kind of take you through this little small engine carburetor tool kit that I got. Um, I'll put a link in the description uh, for anybody who wants to send one or two cents my way. Uh, you can pick it up at Amazon. Uh, it's pretty nice. Uh, the, the, the reason that I bought it is because it comes with this little spline tool. There was no place locally that I could find uh, this little spline tool for adjusting that, that pull and pro um, carburetor. It wasn't running smoothly right away. It wasn't running all that well right away until I was able to get this this kit with this spline tool and able to adjust those high and low jets. Now it's pulling really hard and it's really made an improvement. The kit comes with 14 different screwdriver style adjustment tools. Uh, the main one being this spline tool, but then it comes with a bunch of other stuff. Uh, I'll flip the camera around here and we can kind of go through it. There is two spline tools in here. There's a seven pin and I think an 11 pin. Um, the 11 pin is the one that I needed. These are probably going to be the ones that you need most on your homeowner type saws. The bigger saws, I believe you should be able to adjust them with your just flathead screwdriver. Another thing that's nice about this kit is it comes with a bunch of these wire brushes and little files for cleaning out your jets. So if you got to tear the carb down and clean out the jets, uh, these are going to come in handy quite a bit. There's a bunch of things in here that I'm not exactly sure what you'd ever need them for. Like there, this one actually has got a threaded end. It's a screw. Um, several other things. There's a couple of nut drivers in here. There's a there's a nut driver, Pac-Man style screwdriver, or an Allen wrench uh, screwdriver, uh, a circle, just a regular flathead screwdriver. Like I said, there's several different things in here. All of them are going to come in handy at some point uh, while you're tearing down small engine carburetors. But the biggest reason why I would buy this kit is these spline tools. Um, the whole kit's only 10 bucks. A lot of the places that I was finding that were selling these spline tools, it was $10 just for this one. Um, so you get the rest of this stuff more or less for free. But the nicest thing that I, I like about this kit is they're square. So the handles are square. So it's really easy to tell when you've made a quarter turn or half a turn, full turn. Um, whereas the regular, your more round screwdriver style ones, um, it's a little bit tougher to, to, tougher to tell. Um, you can check out the description for the link um, at the moment, uh, spring of 2024, end of March here. Um, you're probably going to have to highlight that link and put it in your browser. YouTube's got a couple of little weird things as far as new content creators so that the link isn't live, but it is down there in the description. Um, so if you'd be willing to do that, it'd help me out. It's no cost to you. Maybe throw one or two cents my way. If you found this helpful, subscribe to the channel. Give me a like. Share it with your friends. Um, until next time. Thanks, guys.